And we're back. <laughs> Welcome back to Morb's Menu. So today we are doing another highly requested video and bringing Mitchell back on my channel yeah. and doing another Trader Joe's taste test. A lot of people said they really liked the one that we did for all the fall flavors. So if you haven't seen that, I'll link it for you and it'll be linked down below. But we figured we'd go ahead and do another version of the taste test, but with now with all the winter flavored things. So we have a lot of treats here from Trader Joe's and we're gonna try them. We'll do it the same way we did last time where we kind of taste it and then rate it one out of five. Mm -hmm. um, and we'll let you know what our favorites and least favorites are at the end. So without further ado, let's start eating. Let's do it. <laughs> the new story today. All right, you pick the first one. All right, I think we're gonna do the uh, ginger snowball cookies first. So they're buttery cookies stuffed with ginger and rolled in powdered sugar. It's pretty witchy. Very witchy. <laughs> Very messy. I'm sure. Why are we starting with that? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh, smell like um, ginger. <laughs> Alright, so we're just rating these on taste this time. Last time you were all like rating it on pumpkin spice. Yeah, and just on taste. We're just taste. If it tastes good, you give it a good rating. So this is what they look like. But wait, do you, you not see with the white background? <laughs> my shirt. Yeah. Uh, what? You can see it on my shirt. They're tiny. They're like a quarter, quarter size. Yeah. Are there any winter flavors that you don't like? No. Okay. Well, no. I don't like peppermint schnapps. <laughs> okay, that's very specific. <laughs> Specific. It's very Pacific. Pacific as opposed to Atlantic. Yes. All right, let's try it. Ready? Yep. Oh, that's oh, funky. Mm. What do you think? I think it would taste better if it was a ginger red cookie and not just like ginger in here. Oh, yeah, I don't like ginger. I don't like gingerbread. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> kind of smack me in the okay. face with these. Um, yeah, it's crunchy in the middle, but it also is like kind of like chewy and tacky on the outside. And yeah. it's stuck in my teeth. <laughs> yeah. like but flavor's fine, I guess. The flavor's good, and like I like powdered sugar and ginger, but it's like just like a normal cookie with just like ginger, like a little strand of ginger in here. It's kind of weird. Yeah. I don't know. It's okay. So, should we do? On three. Uh -huh. Okay. One, two, three. Three. Yeah. I mean. Yeah. I mean, it's okay. It's not it. like to start. I feel like yeah. it's fine. I'm gonna change my opinion later, but please, yeah. right in the middle. Yeah. So. All right. So for the second one, we're gonna try these dark chocolate mint coins. So they're mint chocolate cookies coated with dark chocolate. So pretty straightforward. Are they cooked? Oh, wait, are they? Did you not listen to me? <laughs> I was too busy drinking coffee. <laughs> Mint chocolate cookies with coated with dark chocolate. Oh, thank you. Okay. They look like, uh, they look like uh, Thin Mints, like uh, Girl Scout Thin Mints. It's not like it too. But again, the size is like literally the size of quarter, same size as the last one. <laughs> I, mean, I love dark chocolate. I love mint. Yeah, this is delicious. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm and I like that it's dark chocolate too. Cause I feel like if it was milk chocolate, it'd be too sweet. But the dark chocolate has like a good contrast. Yep. I dig the coins. All right. Ready? Three, two, one. Five. <laughs> I already? No, no. Wow. Alright. Yep, yeah, I mean, mm. they're good. I just feel like I want a little more mint in them, I think. What? Alright. I think they were, I think they just tasted like a thin mint. Uh, actually, it wasn't as good as a thin mint girl scout cookie, but. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. So, a four in comparison to a thin mint. A five with no comparison. Okay. All right. Next one, we're gonna do. Uh, 
We'll try these sugar glazed La Cuchin cookies. <laughs> it's probably, uh, I think they're Russian. Okay. And I don't know how to pronounce it. What is it? Though? Oh, what is it? Uh, soft gingerbread with nuts and spices. So another three or less incoming. <laughs> Oh, don't say that ahead of time. <laughs> <laughs> we want to split one? Yeah. Or maybe like split a half of them? Yeah. Bit. They're really big. Oh. oh. <laughs> so, I don't know if you can see, but I'm far away. It's just... <laughs> it's hold, just like, hold your hand up for comparison. Are you not a YouTuber? <laughs> uh, this is my second YouTube video, so... <laughs> we well, put in the other ones, the Christmas mm. one. Oh yeah, true. We don't want someone back. This is this is very uh you know, it's not crunchy. It feels like very soft on the inside. Mm. Dang. Kinda dig that. Mm-hmm. It's not that sweet. Well, no. the outside is sweet, but the inside is not sweet. It's like, I mean I guess because all the spices that are in it. Mm. Is it TJ's brand? Um, like TJ only thing? I don't think so. Also, how are you supposed to pack this back up? <laughs> Make it rip it right in the middle. <laughs> I mean, what? I gotta buy a Ziploc bag with it too? Guess so. Yeah, I don't think this is made by Trader Joe's, it doesn't say. No, well, it looks like <laughs> the font though. I don't yeah, know. We do know our, our fonts. <laughs> Alright. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, four. Three. You, what, what was that? <laughs> I forgot what I was going to say. We counted down. Well, three. But I will, I'm going to move the uh, snowball cookies down to two. I did not really like that. Okay. So I think these are a little better. Yeah. I think I like these. Like, I'd eat a whole one. Not two, <laughs> but a whole one. A whole pack? Yeah, oh. I eat a whole pack of those. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next one, let's do the... Dark chocolate covered espresso beans. I don't think these what, are- The what? The espresso beans? Espresso. Espresso. <laughs> Whatever. I don't think these are actually like winter flavored, but this is the first time I've seen them, so. We'll grab them. I think I've seen them before. Oh. But I do like coffee and chocolate, so. I think that was probably the main reason why we got them in <laughs> Oh, you can smell it as soon as I reopen it. Oh, yeah. I mean, what do you expect it's gonna taste like? <laughs> I don't know that I've ever had this, though. Oh. No? Yeah. I mean, chocolate covered coffee bean. Yeah. But again, I like that it's dark chocolate. Mm hmm. Yep. Okay. okay. All right. I'll count us down. Okay. <clears throat> five, four, three, two, one, five. You're not giving anybody <laughs> a five yet? No, nothing's wowed me. I mean, that's good, and I'd eat a couple of them, but I feel like I could get those like at a coffee shop or like, they taste the same everywhere. There's nothing special about them. Oh, so we're, we're only, I thought we were getting on. How it tastes, yeah, but like, it has to be special to get a five. It's gotta have a little bit of that Christmas miracle. <laughs> <laughs> sure. All right, next one. What is this? Um, peppermint bark popcorn. It sounds delicious already. Yeah. I was excited about this one. They're little balls. Not, not very many. Mm. Well, I'm sure the serving size says otherwise. No. Oh. Six pieces, six servings per container. So there's, yeah, there's probably like 36 in there. <laughs> Quick math. Well, I, I'm just saying. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like the coating, but the popcorn tastes a little stale. Yeah, I feel like that happens with popcorn that gets coated and stuff. Yeah. Mm. I mean, I like the packaging. Yeah. <laughs> that is cute. 
but I mean, what do you think? I think it's really good, but I feel like it's one of those things where like, I might eat one more of them, mm -hmm. but I wouldn't like crack, keep going back for these. Like they're good, but if they were like out at a table at a party, I wouldn't like, I'd get something else. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Ready? Four, three, two, oh. one. Four. Oh, I was gonna say three. <laughs> What? <laughs> I did the same thing that you did. Yeah. You don't, you're hating on everything. I'm not hating on it. Like a three's good. Like I said, I'd eat it. It's not bad. Hating would be like one and two. I'm waiting for those to come out. I might have to change my ginger snowball cookies also though. <clears throat> because if I gave that, yeah, that's definitely a two. Yep, I agree. I'm changing it. Because if I gave that a three, that's definitely a two. Let's do the drink next. <sighs> All right. Um, winter wassail, spiced holiday libation. They were serving this at uh, Trader Joe's when we were there the other day, but <clears throat> Morgan wouldn't let me take a sip of it because it would spoil this yeah, video. Yeah, you gotta get the first reaction on film. So we bought the whole thing instead. So it's bad. <laughs> you can blame Morgan. <laughs> Whoa. Well, I'm just... It's a lot. Well, hopefully it's good. Yeah. Okay. What is it supposed to taste like though? Like I don't understand what that means. Oh okay. God. It's very It says pungent. blend of apple, black currants, and lemon juices from concentrate infused with holiday spices and orange peel. Well I can smell the spices and there's a lot of them. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Cheers. scared. No, it's not bad. It, it, it reminds me of a... Uh, it smells stronger than it actually tastes. Yeah, it does. Um, does it, really? it reminds me of just spiced apple cider. Yeah. Like the spiced sense of it. And I don't know if there's any apple in here, but actually look at that. I just read it. Are you not listening to me at all? <laughs> I'm going to be... Otherwise, I'm going to like, stop repeating yourself. Oh, blend, blend of, of apple. apple. I think I chimed in. He ignored me as per usual. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it just tastes like uh, a variant of spiced apple cider. Yeah, it's not like, like it's very different from the spiced apple cider that we tried mm -hmm. in the last video. Yeah. Like that was definitely very apple-y. This has more of like the lemon and like different spices in it, but yeah, the base is still apple, so it's still yeah. similar, but it's good. I, it's not cold. We didn't have it in the fridge. I oh. definitely think it would be better cold. Yeah. It should true. be a good mixer too. That's also true. <laughs> but we still have our uh, apple cider in the fridge from... No, we don't. Oh, we don't? Oh. Never <laughs> it was mind. in there way too long. <laughs> <laughs> we both said we loved it and like, and we didn't really drink it that much. Yeah, I had like one glass. And that's it. <laughs> so, <clears throat> you know. Shout but this out. is good. What? <laughs> I was going to say shout out to the, the Hydro homies. I drove homies. Only drinking water. Oh. <laughs> and beer. And beer. And anything alcoholic really. Um, oh okay. All right, let's grade it. Moving on. Oh, We haven't right. graded it yet. Sorry. Okay, you need to count down because I have some. Okay, three, two, one, Four. three. Yeah. I don't yeah. know. I not mean, bad, not good. Yeah. It's different, which is why I think I gave it a four versus a three. Mm. But. We probably won't just drink this whole jug. Probably not. Well, I don't know. Like we bring it somewhere. We yeah. might try it. Yeah. Force it down their throats. <laughs> <laughs> bring the funnel. So aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> we'll try. Let's try the cocoa ooze or the hot cocoa ooze. All right. Say. So variant of the pumpkin ooze that we tried. Yep. Which which is also which is a variant of Cheerios. Yes. <laughs> which I will say. I didn't like it that much when we tried it on that video, mm -hmm. but I ended up eating the whole box of that. It was better after it sat, like after it opened. I swear it got better. I don't know if it was just the Cheerios on the bottom. The flavor? The flavoring. Like it was a stronger pumpkin and cinnamon flavor. Mm. Like later on, I finished the whole box and I ate it just like plain like a snack. Yeah. So I don't know if it was because we had it open or if the top ones weren't just as flavorful, but just an update. They were better than we thought. Whoa, there's marshmallows in here. Yeah. 
So this is crispy oat, corn, and cocoa hoops cereal with freeze-dried marshmallows. I didn't realize they were actual marshmallows. And you're supposed to eat it over hot chocolate. Really? You're not. No. What? <laughs> Why would anyone do that? I like that. No, it's called hot cocoas. We need to get a couple of these on the marshmallow, right? Just gonna get a, get a big old handful. And I'd prefer this over milk, but. Yeah, for sure. Uh, this is not gonna, I'm gonna tell you right now, this is not gonna taste the same over milk. Or, oh. You need, you need the marshmallows over milk or something. Yeah. Well, it's just like if you ate, um, this is cereal with marshmallows. Lucky Charms? Lucky Charms. Like those marshmallows are not good yeah. without milk. They gotta absorb something. Yeah. Um, I like it though. It just tastes like uh, like Cocoa Puffs. Yeah, but in cereal form, in Cheerio form. Yeah, and then marshmallows, I guess they add a little bit. Mm -hmm. But my guess is if you put this in milk, the hot cocoa like on the outside of the Cheerio would get in the milk and that would be really good. Yeah. All right, three, two, one, Four. three and a half. <laughs> uh, I was gonna say, they're good, but I just wouldn't buy these over like Cocoa Puffs. But the thing is, I haven't bought Cocoa Puffs in a while, so it's I'm not like I would go in there and buy these. Again. Let's do this one and we'll end with ice cream. Okay. Okay, so next to last is there's milk chocolate smashing s'mores with graham cracker and marshmallow. So, well, I guess this is kind of Christmassy. Let's like do bonfires when it's cold out, right? Yeah. They look like uh, Milky Ways, like a, like a cute Milky Way. Yeah, fat Milky Way. But it's not gonna taste like it. No. Oh, you can't even see. Oh, yeah. That's good. Mm -hmm. Dang. Mm -hmm. I like this a lot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, I mean, it's just like a couple graham crackers, some marshmallow filling, and chocolate, and it's delicious. Mm -hmm. um, luckily, the serving size is two pieces, so. Could have another one, but mm -hmm. I feel like eating all the rest of this stuff right now. <laughs> all right, it's already filled my serving size for chocolate. For mm -hmm. the day. Are you gonna get it? You got it. All right, three, two, one, five. five. Yeah, that one's a standout. Like that's the best one. Yeah. Well, we haven't uh, tried the ice cream yet. Well, okay, ice cream we still gotta try, but I do like the um, these mint thins. You think those are a five? Well, you gave them. I gave them five. Oh. Last thing we're gonna try is the um, JoJo's ice cream. Wait, candy cane JoJo's ice cream. Yeah. So if you don't know JoJo's, did we try any of JoJo's? I don't remember. I've tried them before. So JoJo's are basically Trader Joe's Oreos. Um, so I guess this is their candy cane, like almost like cookies and cream ice cream. Yeah. Hey. I thought it was like plastic. She just touched the big old chocolate chunk. <laughs> I was gonna go for that. So it's like pink. It looks like cookie dough, or not cookie dough, cookies and cream ice cream and some pink ice cream. Yeah. Right here. It's like a. It like, makes me feel like a strawberry, but it's like strawberry. Yeah. You're not gonna uh, spoon feed me? <laughs> can lock of arms. Right. I'm excited for this. I've been wanting to try this since we bought it. Oh. It's cool. <laughs> it's ice cream. Oh, <laughs> uh, it tastes like uh, 
mint chocolate chip ice cream. <laughs> Peppermint's a little bit different than like, I guess, the standard mint, but it's got the ch chocolate chunks in there. It's got the, it's got a little cookies and cream, I guess, but so it kind of just tastes like chocolate chip, mint chocolate chip ice cream. Tastes like mint Oreo. Yeah. Like, not, because there's no chocolate chips in it. It's like if you got a McFlurry from McDonald's and you got Andy's mints and Oreo and you mix it around. Have you ever had from Cookout <clears throat> the mint Oreo? Oh, okay. the Yeah. And that That's exactly right. what it tastes like. If you've ever been to Cookout, I don't know if that, that might be a winter only. I'm not sure. But they have a mint Oreo milkshake. And that's exactly what that tastes like. It's good. Yeah, I like it. Because I, I mean, we both like mint chocolate chip ice cream and mm -hmm. cookies and cream ice cream. So, if you don't like mint chocolate chip, then you probably don't like this. A lot of people don't like mint for some reason. Yeah, a lot of people don't like that ice cream. And, and food. They say it tastes like toothpaste. And yeah. Yeah. I don't get it. I like it. Okay. Final score. Mm hmm. Three, two, one, four. Five. I like it. Yeah. She likes it. <laughs> and you, well, you like it. I like it, yeah. Yeah. I feel like four is like uh, my category where I'd buy it again. Yeah. Five is like excels. Mm -hmm. And three is like, eh, it's, it's good, but I wouldn't buy it probably. Now, I gave one a two, which is these snowball cookies. I would not buy again. No. I feel like I'd recommend it to people that like gingerbread, but. I wouldn't, because I love gingerbread. Never mind. Don't buy it. They have, we didn't try it because I've eaten it before and it wouldn't be fair to taste it, but they have um, little iced gingerbread men at Trader Joe's during the winter time and that, those are really good because it's just like a gingerbread cookie with icing and it's, those are really delicious. Yeah. So I would definitely, I've gotten those before, a little box full of them. Those are not good. Yeah. I would almost go down to a one almost. No. I'm like very disappointed. Because everything else was really good, and that was just like the one thing that I'm like, ew. Yeah. So, I don't think we need to go over least favorite, because we've made that very clear. But we'll I mean, we can put them in order. Ooh, we could. Okay. Are we gonna, we're not going to agree, though. No, we're not. We can try. Well, we can, we can agree we'll on one thing. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. We're going to go from over here to over here, the best and worst. Time's a charm. So, so this, this is the, the final, final lineup. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's from worst to best. We have snowball cookies, drink, popcorn. <laughs> what? <laughs> drink. Okay. We don't agree on that, but I compromise. <laughs> Hot cocoa O's, espresso beans. Espresso. <laughs> espresso beans. Uh, the sugar glaze. I can't pronounce cookies, mint, dark chocolate, mint coins, ice cream, and then the winner is the milk chocolate smashing s'mores. Mm -hmm. These are really, really good. I would definitely recommend these. Yeah, the, I think that these two are like almost a tie for me, but we both significantly like the s'mores from the best. Yeah. So. Yep. Yeah. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. This video will probably be the, well, it definitely will be the last video up before Christmas. So I hope everyone has a Merry Christmas and happy holiday season. Um, Christmas is on a Wednesday, which I, is when I normally post my videos. So I will not have a video on Wednesday post on Christmas. So I'm just going to spend time with my family and do all that kind of stuff. Um, hopefully I'll have a video ready to go up the Sunday after Christmas, kind of in between new year's and christmas but who knows if i don't then i'll see you guys probably the wednesday after that for sure so if you have any video ideas for both of us to do or just me in the future always leave those in comments down below mm -hmm. if you're new here and haven't subscribed make sure you go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the videos that i normally post on wednesdays and sundays thanks again for watching works menu and hope you have a great day bye, bye. <laughs>